Hey, this is Mark. I am the maker of Shipfast, and I'm going to walk you through the code in just two minutes. Once you get invited, you will have access to this GitHub repo. Just clone it and run it on your local machine. There is also a TypeScript version of it if you want to. Um, once you're in your code editor, you'll see this is typical Next.js folder structure. This is using the app router one. Uh, you also get access to the pages router if you want to. And then to get started, it's pretty simple. Just go to the documentation and it's going to tell you exactly what to do, how to set your environment variables, how to set up your config files and all that. Uh, if you follow this tutorial in just five minutes, you can have a landing page that collects email from your potential user for a waitlist, for instance. So let's take this as an example that just follow one of the first steps. If I copy past the code, I'm going to have a uh, nice landing page up and running right here. Um, for each components that come with a bullet plate, there are many of them, um, I write some uh, comments to help you write better copy that sells. Uh, so as you can see here, it's going to tell you how to better write your headlines, how to write your uh, supporting headlines and all that. Um, and then in terms of styling, uh, you can have your custom fonts and you can have access to over 20 themes. So if I try to add the dark theme, boom, here you go. You have the dark one and there are 18 others. And then you will have access to a bunch of features. So um, one of the very cool one is to be able to handle payments with Stripe. So if you go back to our previous example, as you can see here in the checkouts, uh, in the pricing page, it's connected with a Stripe checkout. User will be able to pay. Uh, and in the back end on our Stripe API, we have a webhook for Stripe that's going to handle all the events for us and do the brain work to know whether the user has access or not. Um, it also tells you how to find your API keys in Stripe, how to set up your accounts and all that. Um, we have other features like uh, how to send emails, uh, transactional emails uh, with MailGun, for instance, like sign-in emails and all that. Uh, this can be a real headache uh, if you're doing it for the first time because your emails might end up in a spam folder. It's going to tell you exactly where to click, uh, how to get your keys, uh, how to set up your DNS uh, to make sure that you avoid the spam folder at all costs. There are also some uh, more features like the SEO one, uh, the components, all the UI components are SEO optimized and also it comes with handy features to add um, uh, as good SEO tags to all your pages to make sure that you rank on Google. And there's a support for rich snippets if that's something you're into. Um, if you're not using the same text stack for emails or whatever, uh, you can all easily swap, uh, Shipfast is not closed, so you can easily swap uh, one library for another. Um, I basically built this uh, boilerplate after shipping 20 startups for the last two years and running into a lot of bugs and mistakes. And I packed all my learning into the boilerplate. The goal is to help you save some time, avoid a bunch of headaches, and finally to become profitable faster because